guys, it's Brittany from Coffee Planner Mom, and today I'm going to be planning in my mini happy planner for March the 26th to April the 1st. Now, April 1st is Easter, so I'm going to be using um, the seasonal Mambi, ha uh, Mambi, yes, the seasonal Mambi sticker book. Um, but I'm going to be using the classic size sheets instead of the mini, even though I have the mini too, um, just because I've had this one for like a year and a half now. So I kind of want to use up these stickers. So we're going to go oversized, which is fine because I don't have a whole lot of plans this week. Um, I use my mini as an on the go planner. So because I don't have too much going on, I can go a little bit bigger than usual. So I'm going to use the same washi that I used last week and I'm going to stick it down the sides and I will get this all trimmed up and I will be back in just a moment. All right, so I have my washi down on the edges and it was just from a roll that came from a recollections tube. Um, I have this sticker that we're going to put down. It says visit the Easter Bunny. Um, so really it's the Easter Bunny is going to be visiting us. So I'm going to stick that over here on the side because I don't really, there we go, that works. I don't really use this note section so I don't mind that I'm covering it up. Um, now what we have going on, like I said, I only have two actual things going on. So I'm going to go ahead and mark those off and I think what we'll do is we will just use some of, I've got two flowers, perfect. So we will go with a green flower, if I can get it off the page. And this pink flower too, just to mark the two things that we have to go to on Wednesday. And then I use this as, like I said, it's my on the go planner. So I like to put down places that I need to go, but then I also keep like a running shopping list in here. So I think what we'll do is we will go with this and we'll stick it right over here. And I didn't notice that there was a to buy sticker, so we're going to actually use the to buy sticker because that is, that's what I'm listing in this planner. It's the things that I need to buy. So we will put that right there. Oop. Perfect. And then I'm going to do the same thing over on Friday. So since it's a pink to buy, we're going to go with the green flag. And this is, like I said, it's just from the, um, oh my gosh, I can't get this off. There we go. Um, the classic, sticker book. So that's why things are a little bit bigger, but I tend to write larger in this planner, which is kind of funny because it's like the mini planner and I write really big, but it's just my thing. And I covered up the 31, but I don't necessarily mind that. Um, so we've got that. So that is good. And I've got those things. And like I said, that's basically all I need to do. So we will just go ahead and stick a couple of cute little things down. We've got this Easter egg, so we will, if I can get it off the page, my fingers are just not working. There we go. And we will stick that here. Oh, I kind of want it on more of like an angle. There we go. So we're gonna stick that here because it is Easter and I thought I had, oh, Some of the pages have fallen out of the book, but some of them are still here. So I've got a bunny and we'll stick him on Easter, even though we already have a bunny down at the corner, I still would like to put him here. And I'm not even going to worry about April Fool's Day. We're just going to put the little bunny and I have a carrot. And we'll just put the carrot right down here. So we have this cute little cluster for 
Easter. And I actually think that's all I'm going to do this week. Um, my kids have spring break, so a lot of stuff is just kind of up in the air right now. So this gives me plenty of space to write in anything that does happen to come up. But then I have my space to write down my list that I know I'm going to need to buy. So if you like this video, please be sure to give me a thumbs up. Hit the subscribe button if you haven't already so that you don't miss out on any of my other videos. And be sure to follow me over on Instagram. Over there I'm at Coffee Planner Mom, uh, so that you don't miss out on any of my posts and things. And that's it for today. I'll see you guys later.